Hey everyone, it's TrainGuy1969, and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to continue to take a look at some of the road switchers that I have in my collection. This is an Elko S2 diesel switcher. Uh, these particular locomotives, again, would have been built by the Elko company or its Canadian division, the Montreal Locomotive Works, between 1940 and 1950. These would have been used in the yard to shunt uh, freight cars around or to be used to help build up trains. This one here I've got lashed up to three cylindrical grain cars. So we're going to get this one moving and we will see how it does. Here we go. By no stretch of the imagination is this the fastest of my locomotives, but I will say it hasn't been run a whole lot, so it may just need a little bit of uh, working in time. But it's doing an okay job pulling these three grain cars. And as it continues along, it seems to be picking up a bit more speed. I've always loved the look of these locomotives. And again, this one is in the CP Rail Multimark or Pac-Man paint scheme from the 1970s through till, I believe it's the early 1990s. Don't believe any of these are in service anymore with Canadian Pacific Railways, but you might find them here and there in various uh, short lines. So we're going to bring her back around, we'll have her park, we'll take a closer look at it. We'll just bring it up a little further and that's good right there. So there we have the S2 road switcher from Elko. Again, this is a Bachman DCC ready product. And we'll get her going one more time around. These locomotives were built particularly to function as road switchers, unlike a lot of the locomotives you see today working as switchers, which tend to be older models like GP38-2s and SD40s and whatnot, which had been prime movers at one point in their, in their lives. But these ones were built just to be switchers and be used in the yards. They don't have a huge amount of horsepower to them, but again, they're not pulling huge loads, so they were quite functional for the purpose that they had at the time. And we'll let her go by one more time here. And again, thank you for visiting my channel. I hope you enjoyed the video. Look forward to having you back again. Enjoy the rest of your day. We'll see you soon.